Hey, what's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. And today I am going to be unboxing Green Goblin and Venom from the Spider-Man sets in Disney Infinity Poison 2.0. Um, not sure which one you watched before this. The video before this could have been my unboxing of Tinkerbell and Hero. Uh, if it is, go and watch that. If not, well, it'll be after this video. But, um, I, as I said in that video, I've got loads and loads of these to unbox because I've had been buying these left, right and centre quite cheap. Uh, 350 Fiverr, I can't remember. There's been like loads of sales on these lately. Uh, I've got a ton to unbox. Um, and yeah, I'm doing WWE as well, so if you're liking WWE stuff, then comment below if you're liking that, because I'll be doing some more on those. Uh, buying quite a lot of WWE stuff lately, as my previous videos have mentioned. Um, yeah, so these were from the Spider-Man set. I haven't actually unboxed Spider-Man yet. I've got that to come, and I think I've got Aladdin one to come, and quite a few that I've been buying, as I said. Um, some 2.0, 2 1.0. As I said, I think I'm nearly... I think I've five from both, well, you know, between the two sets, I think I've got five to get and I've got the whole set from series one and two. Not really collecting 3.0, uh, because I'm not really in Star Wars, as most of you know, well, most of the regulars that I talk to know. Um, but I have got a few of the, like, Mickeys and Minis and um, some of the Disney ones. So uh, there will be some of those on the channel at some point. Uh, but yeah, let's get me sop me waffling and let's get on with these um should i do venom first so let's do venom first um i'm looking forward to playing the spider-man one actually i just haven't got round to playing it yet um and i want to play the aladdin toy box thing as well that was quite cool so yeah um let's get venom out he's massive he's really heavy actually um quite a bit like the hulk the hulk one was quite heavy um so yeah let's get this out and have a look at this um, wow, really heavy. It's been difficult to get out of the packaging. Uh, not good. Right, here we go. Wow, quite a bit of base as well. Look at that base. Wow, that's quite cool. As I said in previous videos, I love these figures. They are so well detailed. Like, just well painted, well detailed. Like, look at that tongue. Like on the back, sometimes like you get toys and like not paint on the back or they're not painting on the legs or you know, there's always paint missing. Like these ones are like spot on. You know. I don't know how they do it. There's a bit of dirt on that, just get rid of that. But yeah, so like base the base there. I think all the information is kind of in here. And then you just get the figure. But I love this. Um there is a different version of this. I think it might be the Black Spider-Man when you get with the Vita version, I do want to get at some point. But I've got so many versions of these games, guys. Um, I think I've got Wii U version, I think I've got PS3 version at some point, I think I've got Xbox 360, Xbox One. I've got all different versions of these games. Um, so yeah, it's kind of getting a bit ridiculous, to be honest. But hey-ho, I do like the figures. Um, so yeah, that's Venom, so that's really cool, put in there. And I think if I double check the box, I should have a, uh, I should have a code. Oh, you've got the piece of information, which we don't need. And then there's a picture, which I really like the artwork for these as well. The artwork's kind of cool. And if I flip it over, um, not showing the code, there's a picture of the figure as well with the code, which you can use on the, as far as I know, I'm not sure if it still works, but there should be a online game you can play as well, which gives you the figure if you put the code in. Um, so yeah, so that's that. So just click that over really quickly and put that there. And we'll get on with the Green Goblin. Now this one looks really, really cool. I've been wanting to unbox this one for a long time. So I'm going to get this unboxed. Um, there's quite a few I actually want to unbox. I've got, um, I've got Baymax in that as well somewhere. I need to unbox him. I really want to get him out and have a look at him. So there's that. Let's get rid of that for a minute. And we we'll get rid of these. I do waffle on in these videos, don't I? Oh well. <laughs> Part of YouTube, I guess. Hearing different people's opinions. So, here is the Green Goblin. Again, the base is kind of like a black sort of stone base. Then you've got the legs. Just, just really well painted and well detailed. And I just 
like even that like look it's just like the, the colors and they didn't have to paint that yellow you know but they did and you, you see some toys like i've seen a lot of the power ranger ones recently and they've like got no paint on or oh just horrible so these ones are like really well detailed they're not even action figures or anything they're just, they're just like little statues and i just think they're amazing even if you don't play the game as i said before just collect them as you know statues or figures to put on your shelf so yeah that's green goblin i really like that one uh two really big figures as well there so let's get the uh, information out the uh, little pamphlet that we don't need and then the artwork again really cool superhero series the other ones are the originals which is the like disney ones um well they're all disney but the disney like classic ones there's the green goblin picture there which is really cool so we'll just flick that over really quickly and put that there so yeah this is gonna do it for this video guys so please like subscribe and comment and all that jazz um and i'll speak to you in the next video thanks for watching bye guys